Hello and welcome to Capital City Opera's virtual dinner and a diva of opera's greatest hits. Tonight we will feature selections that opera lovers and opera newbies alike can enjoy. Our featured singers are Jessica Dennison, Heather Witt, Jose Caballero, and Mitch Gindelsberger with Catherine Giel at the piano. Sit back, relax, and enjoy some of the most famous pieces from the opera repertoire. you heard was from Verdi's La Traviata and is a drinking party song. The text includes sentiments such as, be happy, wind and song and laughter beautify the night, let the new day find us in paradise. The next piece also speaks about love and pleasure in a different way. The habanera from Carmen is the first time we hear the title character in the opera. She describes love as a gypsy child, a rebellious bird, something that you hope to catch but can never control. Of course, she is describing herself. Oh, 
The next aria is another famous piece from Carmen, the bullfighter song sung by Escamillo. He describes exciting scenes in the bullring, the cheering of the crowds, and the fame that comes with victory. We invite you to sing along with the chorus at home.
The next aria is from Puccini's opera La Rondine. In this aria, Magda tells a story about a woman named Doretta who chooses a poor student over a king because she values true love over riches. In contrast to Magda's sentiments on true love, the aria La Donna e Mobile from Verdi's Rigoletto literally means woman is fickle and is sung by the Duke of Mantua, a notorious womanizer. You will no doubt be familiar with this tune not only from opera, but from commercials, cartoons, and other popular culture. In fact, Verdi knew he had written a hit melody and only gave the score to the singer hours before the premiere so that it would not leak to the public too soon. After opening night, everyone was humming it in the streets the next day.
Another beautiful piece of music that has been included in tons of popular media from movies to airline commercials is the flower duet from Lakme. In this scene, the two women are gathering flowers by a river and commenting on the beauty of nature, while the melody of the voices and the piano underscore the flowing water. The men will now have a turn at another famous duet from Bizet's Pearl Fishers. The men in this story were once close friends, but have fallen in love with the same woman. This duet recalls the first time they ever saw her and the effects she had on them. At the end, they vow to renounce their love and remain loyal friends to each other.
piece, we will hear the quartet from Rigoletto, a musical masterpiece featuring four characters singing intricately written music, each with their own unique and overlapping agendas. The Duke is trying to seduce Madalena, and she responds by coyly rebuffing his advances. Gilda, looking on from hiding with her father Rigoletto, feels betrayed, and Rigoletto consoles her and plots to kill the Duke. We hope you enjoy this final scene and look forward to seeing you again soon. Thank you for your support. Thank you. 